What's going on guys? It's Justin here again and it's 10.30 on Wednesday night here in Lynchburg. I just got back from my shift at Macy's, hence I'm all dressed up. It was a good shift. I worked in women's shoes again, same department I was in on Black Friday. Very chill. I mean, it was it was almost boring just because there was like hardly any people there. Everyone was taken care of really quickly and so I was just called in last minute. I was asked yesterday if I would come in. I agreed to the evening one and then this morning I was asked if I would come in earlier. What do you mean earlier? What about one? Um, what are the hours? And so they said one to ten. I'm already working six to ten. How about four to ten? Okay, and so it's like nine hours and I had just spent ten hours there on Black Friday. I was just taking a day away from the office just so I could focus and be able to get more things done without being bothered in person. I was just like, I come in at four. It was a good shift. That's what I was up to today. It doesn't hurt to make a little bit of money. And then earlier today, I was just hanging out with Meg, getting a few things done here and there. It was a long day. I got up at around eight. Sorry I didn't vlog all day. We were out and about. Again, one of those things where I don't have one of the point and shoot cameras that I can take with me. I'm going to try to come a little bit closer to the camera this time so you guys can actually hear me better because whenever I'm working with a sound on these things it just doesn't come through as loud as I would like to so I don't know if it's just me being a quiet person because I am naturally I don't talk very loudly and I don't talk all that much generally but I know that this is most of what my vlogging is and most of what a person's vlog is anyway is talking I'm talking about going to DC this weekend which is kind of a spontaneous let's go there because we wanted to go and check out some home stuff not like we are moving in together but we're very into IKEA mutant named stores, like the nice stores for home furnishings, we like to go to those. A lot of our trips revolve around what cuisine we want to eat. Being that she's Filipina, we tend to revolve around that. Anything Asian, Filipino, Japanese, stuff like that. I love it. Um, she loves it obviously because it's her culture, it's her heritage, and the food's delicious anyway. We went to Hibachi Grill Buffet earlier today for lunch. I wasn't even in need of a fix of Asian food. I had sushi for the first time since our anniversary. The last time we had sushi, it was very fresh. It was delicious some of the best sushi that we've ever had. It was just this one little thing about it. They put wasabi and just a little bit into every piece of sushi that we ate. And we didn't specifically request that. After a good like 10 pieces of sushi, you really start feeling the heat. Even if you have a high heat tolerance, you can definitely start feeling it because the little bits of it stay with you. When you have a certain amount of sushi, not only are you filling up on it, but you're also getting that like, okay, I'm heating up. If you're in close quarters with people, which generally a lot of non chain restaurants are, then you really start feeling that heat. Like, why is all the sushi so hot right now? After about 10 pieces, we were feeling the wasabi, a uh, little bits of it. Say, here's the fish, is the top layer, the rice. Well, in between the rice and the fish, they had inserted just a little clump of wasabi. And it made it good. It gave it a good little kick. But again, after about 10 pieces, you're just like, oh, okay, we're good. Tapping out and stuff. We're done. We're gonna um, call it a night here. I need to eat and I will catch you guys on Friday possibly. We'll see. The rain has been getting to me a little bit, just making me a little bit tired because it's rained so much. This has been like four or five consistent days of rain. Every day has gotten heavier rain. Today was just outrageous. All the guys at work, we were just like, another rainy day. We don't really complain that much about it. We work inside, so we don't really get affected by it that much. But walking between our cars and the offices gets to be a hassle because we're not dressing so much for weather. We're dressing for comfort, being that we're in an office. And we want to be able to dress jeans, a t-shirt, or like not a very thick colored shirt. So we have to wear all these layers. And it's cold here in Lynchburg. We're just... <laughs> over this rain. Hopefully this is the extent of winter because it's supposed to be sunny the next four days. Decently warm by that I mean like 50s or 60s as a high which is warm for right now because it's been like 30s and 40s lately. We're lucky if it reaches 60 right now. I know that people in different states are like oh come on that's not bad. Lynchburg doesn't get a lot of inclement weather. The most we get is rain. We don't get a lot of snow until January February. <laughs> We're just done with the rain. Let's get out of here. That's my little rant for now. It's dark as you can tell. We're gonna be caught in the night here like I said so I will catch you guys later. Have a great night. Peace out.